Okay. Now, young man, Zachary, you so pleasantly and beautifully relaxed. In the next few days and weeks, you're going to find you're able, completely able, to consume new foods, including hot dinners, roast dinners. You're going to find it exciting instead of stressful. Zachary has, uh, since he was about 18 months old, um, refused hot dinners and got very stressed and upset um, over the, the process of potentially eating a hot dinner. Um, and um, he's basically taken to just eating cheese, soft cheese sandwiches or soft cheese on toast. And that's basically been um, the main bulk of his diet since he was 18 months old up until now. Um, Zachary last year was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes so obviously diet is even more important for Zachary now. Um, he needs to um, learn about the importance of, of food and, and now's the time really for, for, for change. I'm David Kilmurray, also known as the Food Doctor. Uh, I suffered myself with selective eating disorder or ARFID uh, as I diagnosed Zachary with uh, as uh, soon as he came through the doors, bless him. Uh, him and his mum have done extremely well. We use a concoction of cognitive behavioural therapy, CBT, NLP and uh, clinical hypnotism uh, to help people to get a result. Uh, I've devoted my life to helping people. I've got my senior qualifications to do so. Uh, but the most important thing is having that empathy to understand it uh, myself and uh, bless Zach straight away. He's opened the doors. Uh, he had a roast dinner immediately after coming out of the hypnotism, uh, having had no hot dinners previously and obviously being stuck with these uh, dairy cheese sandwiches which he'd uh, eaten all of his life, pretty much. Um, but he's done so, so well. I can't say how proud I am of him and everybody else that's come through the doors. Well done, Zach. You know, I think I can eat any, ev ev everything now. Everything in the whole entire world. Never having a dairy sandwich again.